What's up, y'all? Welcome to Mindo, Ecuador. If you're new, I'm Alex Eikhoff, and I am a muralist from Kansas City, Missouri, US of A. And for the first few months of 2023, I've been traveling around South America painting murals with my girlfriend, Amanda Noel. We embarked on this journey because we were invited to stay with our friends, Paul and Carrie, a couple of former college professors who are now living part-time in the cloud forest. They own a hotel, Hotel Libertad in Mindo, and they asked us to come visit and stay for free. And of course, we couldn't pass up that opportunity, so we packed our bags, I moved out of my old house and studio, and we went to Ecuador and stayed for a month in Mindo at this very hotel. And while we were there, I went ahead and painted them a custom mural in their lobby, which you will see in this video. But first, let me give you a tour of the hotel. Esta es la cocina, the kitchen. La vista de la cocina, the view from the kitchen. The little dining area. This is where they have breakfast for the guests. But most of the time, we have it to ourselves. La cocina. And then from the cocina, we down the stairs. And this is like a little hammock area, lounge. This is where we read our books, our Kindles. And these two hammocks here, she goes there, and I go here. And then from the lounge, this is the rest of the hotel. Amanda's hanging our laundry. We've got a couple rooms. Here's the lobby. This is the wall. A couple more rooms. And then our suite is up there, the honeymoon suite. Couple more rooms. La piscina, the pool. A few rooms on the bottom, a few rooms on top. See how the roof is? Everything has like an overhang because it rains. And this is the roof in the lobby. Well, stairs going down to the garage. We have the Lavanderia, we do our laundry, a piscina, bird murals that are kind of all around town. And this is the Calle Street right outside. Most of the roads are dirt, some are paved. See those clouds? That's pretty much what it looks like most of the time. One of my favorite parts about Mindo was all the birds. This is considered to be one of the bird watching capitals of the world. This region of South America is considered to be one of the densest populations of the biggest variety of birds on the planet. I'm not doing a great job of describing this, but you get it. There's a lot of birds. A lot of people come to Mindo just for the birds. We regularly saw toucans. We didn't get to see the cock of the rock, but we saw plenty of hummingbirds. So naturally, I had to choose this creature as my feature for this mural, and I picked the violet-tailed sylph because it's just a magical little bird. Now let's get to painting. Our time in Mindo was relaxing. It was a nice change of pace from our typical United States routine of 
working all the time and it was a much needed getaway. Okay, have fun. I've read a lot of books while we were here. It's a pretty mellow town, so there's not a ton to do other than enjoy the awesome local cuisine and explore the natural landscape, which we did plenty of. We went on some hikes, ate a lot of good food, and that was great. We realized a couple things about ourselves that we are pretty introverted, so we mostly stuck to ourselves and didn't completely immerse ourselves in the culture, which I guess is a small regret. Not a regret, just I wish I would have challenged myself a little more. It's just challenging enough to get outside of your comfort zone and explore a new place. I actually felt happiest when I was painting this mural. I like to have something to do. I like to have a mission. And I've realized that art is one of my favorite things to do with my time. I prefer it to doing touristy things. So even though we were in a different place, I still enjoy doing the same thing that I would back in the United States. I think I'm going to eventually put together a video of our experience in Mindo. Um, not so much about art. Usually this channel is art centric. It's not a travel vlog, but I think I'm going to do a, a video kind of montaging some of our favorite aspects of living in Mindo for a month. So if that's interesting to you, stay tuned for that video. And thanks for watching this one. I appreciate that. What am I doing here? Break it out of here. Will you look at Hotel Libertad and tell me if it's stupid as f I give you permission. It's stupid. It's stupid. I give you permission to say it's stupid as f No, I don't think it is. I like the hotel tomorrow. Hotel Libertad. 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 Hotel Libertad. All right, everybody. Thank you for watching this video. If you've made it this far, please consider subscribing if this video has brought you any value whatsoever, whether it's entertainment, inspiration, motivation. I do want to point out that I have a podcast and it's catered to new artists or anybody trying to pursue a career based around their passions. I have reinvented my life and really given myself a sense of meaning and purpose by pursuing my passions for art and painting. And this project in particular is a good example of how I have combined my passions of painting and travel and used my mural work to give me free lodging while I'm traveling. And I hope that's inspiring for you if you're somebody who, who shares those passions. And there'll be more content coming soon that will encourage this type of lifestyle. So consider subscribing, liking, all that jazz. Thanks for tuning in and sticking with the video this far. Here's the final shots.